If you want to know the step-by-step -step process to apply permanent residency of Canada, this video is for you. In this video, I will tell you each and every step involved in applying permanent residency of Canada. Hello everyone, this is Abu from Literally Canada. Do you wish to travel to Canada via express entry and know all the process? Then please do visit my channel. I am creating video every week on Canada immigration with latest updates. Stay tuned. So this is divided into six different steps. The first one is credential evaluation and the second one is language test and the third one is profile creation and the fourth one is arranging the required documents. And the fifth one is submitting the application finally with stamping. Let's start with ECA. ECA is nothing but a report which is evaluated by an independent company to make sure your foreign degree or a certificate is legit and equal to a Canadian one. Below are few independent companies which actually evaluate your degree. Comparative Education Services, ICAS, IQAS, ICES and finally the World Education Services which is also known as WES. People mostly use WES which is the fastest and cheapest among all these and the validity of this report is five years and the cost would be around 200 to 250 Canadian dollars the approximate processing time is one to four months the next step is language proficiency you need to prove the Canadian government about your language skills by taking an approved language test in four modes which is reading writing speaking and listening the test can be either taken in two languages english or french let's see about the english tests in english there are two types of tests taken one is ielts general test the second one is selpip general test which is in the countries like canada india uae usa and philippines in india there are only limited centers available for selpip now the validity of this report is two years from the date you receive the report and the fee would be around 250 Canadian dollars and the time frame for the result and preparation may vary from 1.5 to 3 months. The next step is profile creation. We have to create an express entry profile but before that we need to have two prerequisites which is language test and ECA report. Basically, these are the step one and step two. So this is required to create any profile in Express Entry. Based on the job, you have to choose your own NOC code. NOC code will vary based on jobs, roles and responsibility. For example, an IT industry network admin would have a different NOC code and a software developer would have a different NOC code. After creating a profile successfully in online based on few parameters like your age, education, job experience, marital status, etc., a CRS score will be calculated. A CRS score is a comprehensive ranking system which is calculating the points based on all these parameters. You would receive an ITA which is also known as an invitation to apply from a government of Canada if your CRS score is equal or greater than the cutoff draw. What if your CRS score is less than 400? Not to worry, you can create and apply any different PNP programs as well. PNP program is a provincial nomination program and you can show your express of interest and apply to any PNP program separately. The next step is document preparation. We have to make sure all the documents are submitted within 60 days. Earlier it was 90 days, now they have reduced it to 60 days. Below are the documents which are required to be submitted within 60 days. The first one is a reference letter for each work experience declared. So if you have worked for four companies, you have to get a reference letter from all the employers. A medical certificate. A PCC which is a police certificate, proof of fund by a bank which is embedded in a bank letterhead, a marriage certificate, 
a birth adoption or a birth certificate, passport, photographs, a language test, as well as an ECA report. If you have applied to any PNP program, you have to submit the nomination letter. And if you have any LMIA approved job offer, you have to attach that as well. The next step is uploading the documents. So you have 60 days of time frame to upload all the documents. You have to scan all the documents clearly and upload them. Also, while submitting the online application, it will ask you the proof of past 10 years of travel history as well as the residence proof. So you have to provide a detailed information of where you stayed, where you travel. So what is the residential proof for the past 10 years? Also, you have to pay the visa fee as well as the application fee online. If you see below, I have provided an official screenshot which shows you how much is the fee. For an individual, it is almost 1,040 Canadian dollars, which is without the permanent residency fee, which is 550 Canadian dollars. If you are adding your spouse, it is another 1,040 Canadian dollars. The processing time will vary from one to six months. The final step is stamping. Once you receive the confirmation email from IRCC, you have 30 days time frame to submit few documents to the VFS office. After receiving the confirmation email for your permanent residency, a single entry visa has to be stamped in your passport. This visa is used as a single entry to Canada. Also, you have to pay a small amount of fee to the VFS center to make sure your passport is couriered. Only the passport as well as few photographs needs to be submitted. They will ask for the letter which you received as a confirmation email. You should be taking a printout to submit to them. The single entry visa is for the first time and once you entered Canada, this visa is going to be invalid and you will be provided a permanent residency document to travel further. After two to three months, you will receive your PR card for the future travel. The processing time for this one is one to two weeks. So this is all the step-by-step -step process for the Canadian immigration on the permanent residency. If you have any doubts, please post your questions in the comment box. I will reply you as soon as possible. And also do not forget to subscribe to the channel and share with your friends. Thank you.